Namaskaram. Today I have a very interesting topic for you. What are the things that you have to keep in mind if you want to become a performer? The meaning of a performer in the dictionary is somebody who entertains an audience. But in Carnatic music, we call a performer as an artist. And that has a very different meaning. It says an artist is a person who is skilled at a particular task or occupation. My dear students, doesn't this second meaning fit well to the topic? Unless you are very skilled with your instrument and understanding your art really well, it is very tough to survive as a performer. It is only when you are confident about your art can you entertain an audience. So the first requisite for being a successful performer is extreme love and dedication to the art that you have chosen. Then follows the quest for knowledge in that skill. Planning, hard work, networking and so on. When you have reached the advanced level, uh, when, where uh, you are confident of the different areas of Carnatic music, then you must attempt to give performances to a small audience. And if the audience is a small family gathering, you can keep doing it from the intermediate uh, stage itself. Performing at school and college festivals also boost your confidence. Stage fear will go with these experiences. So apart from mastering the skill, you must also see that you eliminate stage fear by giving these performances to small audiences, wherever you get a chance. In the meantime, learning more Kritis and songs in various languages is very important. Also, maintain a logbook of all the songs you know. Keep practicing all of them in rotation. When you learn a new Kriti, boldly go and play it in many places until you get confident with it. Listen to masters of the music system frequently and imbibe their thought processes. Today, the audience is very diverse and will be thrilled if a familiar song is played. Go out of your way to know your audience and plan accordingly. Endearing yourself to your audience through your skill is top priority, followed by being friendly. Make yourself easily accessible through interactions with the audience. Be accepting of your shortcomings and overcome them. Once you have reached a decent level of space in the performance arena, you can shift to your niche skills. By which I mean, if you are good at playing alapanas, do more of it. A few students of mine have shifted to playing abangs on the veena. Some want to play old film classics. Some want songs in a particular language more than in the others. This is like specializing. But this transformation should come only after you have established yourself very well with the Carnatic music system. Finally, if you want to take it as a profession, be sincere about it. This means choosing songs responsibly and being a good team player. After all, you have to play with uh, a co-artists, percussionists. So you have to be a good team player. Also respect and appreciate other artists in this field and their skill. Finally, even a successful artist should continue to be a good student. Therefore, always be curious and willing to learn new things. My sincere blessings and best wishes to all of you out there who want to become performers. Thank you.